Okay, so we start with the, the cream cheese is already in there, so we're gonna start with the sour cream and just cream get it all. Cream cheese base, sour cream on top. Yeah, it's just like a beautiful dairy bomb. I was just gonna uh, say, I already love this dish I so know. much. It's so tasty. It's, it's like, I don't know if anyone who's watching has ever really had kugel. It's a, it's a Jewish dish, but it's like a delicious like noodle sweet pie. I don't know. Casserole. Sweet noodle pie. Sweet noodle pie. Like, doesn't that just sound so good? Yes. And then we, oh my God, this is so heavy. We put the eggs and this is like all the it wet ingredients heavy. together. It's like eggs, vanilla, something else. I don't remember. And you just pour that right in. If you go to our website, the full recipe from Cindy, Penny, and Joey will be on it. It is? The famous kugel. Yes. It's so fancy schmancy. We try. Okay, then we're gonna go with our cottage cheese. I personally, unless it's in this kugel, I'm not a huge cottage cheese lover. I love it. My mom raised me on it. California 1970s, the pink Knudsen carton. I, it's like Pavlovian for me. It really is. You're just gonna like fold that in, like whisk it up a little bit. And remember like how that was like the businesswoman's diet special, like I'll have half a grapefruit with some cottage oh cheese and God. a maraschino yes. cherry on top. Okay, so this is all mixed in, it's good. We can throw this on top of our egg noodles. And my cousin Cindy <laughs> made sure to tell me to tell your producers to get full fat everything. You can't go like 2% or anything like healthy alternatives with this. If you're making kugel, you just gotta really Commit. lean into the, um, just the everything. <laughs> All right, okay, so we're gonna do that, and then I can't remember, she's gonna be so mad, if I sprinkle the cinnamon and sugar before or after, I think it's before. Yeah, it's before, okay. So we're gonna sprinkle this today on top. Today we'll do before. Yeah, today we'll do before. Cindy, if that's wrong. Oh, I sort of I'm went so on sorry. top, should I mix together? I mean, you know, it's your kugel, whatever All you right. wanna do, I don't know. It's my kugel and I can... It's my kugel, I can cry, cry if I want to. to. This is gonna be so tasty. And then we're done. I mean, it's the easiest thing to make. You just kind of just chuck it in the oven. And then the magic of television. Bruh. And then, yeah, what we're gonna do is put it in. Time and temp, by the way. Oh dear. I know. <laughs> That's a heavy dish. <laughs> Time and temp on the kugel. You're gonna go top, I'll go... Like, how long in the oven, what temperature, how? Oh no, did I write that down? I can't remember. It'll be on the website. Yeah. Oh gosh. So, so, oh my God, look, it's ready. How did that happen? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, it's amazing. 350 degrees for about 20 minutes. That's what I said. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's what I said, I knew that. Um, and this is so exciting. I've always wanted to do like a cooking segment on a show. What started you on your Instagram journey of like putting all your cooking on there? Um, my boyfriend is an amazing cook. Really? Amazing. And so he really got me into cooking and then once I started, I just could not stop. Cooking's the best. It's so like fun, it's therapeutic. I like the amount of time it takes. And I'm gonna take my dairy pill. Oh, yeah. Right, now we've turned into a couple of old ladies. I'm like, get your <laughs> pills, honey. You know, where's our knitting needles? Let's go. I know. There's your water, darling, before we eat the kugel. <laughs> 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 We're gonna just be here all day like this. People are like, huh. And then, and then you just chow down. I also like cooking because I like to eat. Also like, I might have to do the ghost thing with you with the kugel, as promised. Oh my God, so good. So this is, this is Cindy's famous kugel. And if you look under your seats, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> There's a, there's a kugel for everyone. I'm sorry, that's not true. Um, no, that's not true. I mean, I don't mean to be creepy, but can I please give you my phone number? Yeah, please, I would love that. I need to keep laughing with you. Can I give you mine? Yes, please. Can we go on a date? Yes, indeed. I am so, I've, I've always loved you so much. Um, thank you so much for coming on this show. By the way, The In-Between is available to stream tomorrow on Paramount.